Mm, hello guys, it is I, Dreamer here, with some more DSAF Dave Edition. Uh, what's Dave Edition, you ask? It's whenever I go with Dave's plan and stab a few people, which, let me assure you, very legal. If you if I catch you doing it, you're going to be at the short end of the stick, and the next day, you will regret it, okay? So, just as a safety reminder, real life, don't stab people, please, for the love of God. No joke. Please, don't stab. Stabby bad. Bad stabby. Oh, oh. Purple man. You made it, old boy. In fact, I did. Did you tell don't face anything? Yes. I sure as heck didn't. Wait, governor. Sticking me with heck. We don't need that shit to deal with. I need your help moving bodies. During the day, you couldn't have, like, called me at night, even though you don't have my phone number. <laughs> I can refuse him. I'm already going with him, so I'm sure. Why one by one, though? Not so well am I carrying them in. Like the front door is through the prize corner. Good luck. Seriously, though, what am I carrying them in? Am I just holding a child? Like, hey, guys, I know this, this child is kind of, like, bleeding, but I'm just taking him outside to the dumpster. Hospital. Good thing he's on your side. Heh, <laughs> right? Well, uh, I think I should be wearing a suit before I start carrying Hello. bodies. Hello. Uh, 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 uh. Another tape successfully listened to. I really hope I have to wear the suit and carry the bodies. It'll be kind of concerning if I wear the suit, then it's gonna like game over me. Thinking that would make kind of sense because you know, it's an animatronic, so it must have some empty space. So I could just kind of like, oh shoot, I'm not paying attention, put it in the chest area, right? I mean, it's like wearing a big jacket and you put your legs into it when you're cold. So just put a, put a tiny child in there. That sounded so weird. Two very small bodies were collected. Alright, it's time to go skedaddle my way out of here. So let's just, um, very slowly go to the prize corner. And then leave, I guess. I'm not going to perform with two dead kids. That's that's not okay. I mean, for Freddy's it probably is. Hey, it's me. I'm mad. I work at the prize corner. Everyone loves me. Give me fast tokens, and I'll give you prizes. Wait, Pat, Matt? Are you the guy from Theory Game? <laughs> um, Matt, you will die alone. Yes. Uh oh, <laughs> hello, employee. I see you're wearing your suit. You're such a good employee, you know that? In fact, I... I... What on earth are you holding behind your back? A coup doggo, a child corpse, or I don't even know anymore. Uh, I think we know what we're going with. A coup doggo. Stop picking up random doggos, seriously. It's like five doggos that keep popping up around this place. It's just bizarre. The only ones I ever count is the rego regular doggo or rego doggo and the, you know, the purple one that we saw last time. Shadow doggo that becomes surprisingly relevant to the uh, lore later in the series. Which makes me wonder, did direct doggo plan all of this out from the start? Lore outside of the lore? What if I just don't dispose of the bodies? Cause I'm like, actually no, no. <laughs> Ignore what I was about to say. Um, cause that, that what I was about to say might have been a bit. Uh, never mind. It's just, you should my cat is aggressive. I wish you'd be a bit more quiet i can just hear him jumping around in the distance i don't know if you guys could hear it but probably not because no one's ever commented on it before so i doubt they would comment it now i mean i have said i had a cat but i haven't said that uh it's aggressive hmm, more
more bodies. Quite a uh, weird thing to do. Imagine going to your local Chuck E. Cheese pizzeria and just uh wait, does Chuck E. Cheese even exist anymore or didn't they go out of business? I can't remember now if they went out of business now, if they came back and reopened. Well just imagine if you went to your local abandoned uh Chuck E. Cheese this pizza place and arcade aroni and you just saw Chucky e. Chuck Cheese himself, Charles Entertainment Cheese. Carrying around a, a bloody bag. That'd be kind of concerning. Also, you want to hear something that I uh, am a bit embarrassed of? When I was like five years old and... Well, I wasn't five years old, but whenever I was young and Five Nights at Freddy's came out. For some reason, I was I put Chuck E. Cheese and Five Nights at Freddy's together in the same place in my brain. So when I was young, I was always scared of Chuck E. Cheese after Five Nights at Freddy's came out. And ever since then, I've always been like... Not scared, but unsettled by, like, dead mannequin eyes. Did the option change to one body, or is it still two? Alright. Uh-oh. 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 Hey there, old sport. Hello. You're doing fucking great. Thank you. The evidence is mostly gone. Thank you. I'm satisfied with how you've helped me today, old sport. Thank you. Let's give ourselves an early pay off with all these dead kids. Own face shouldn't notice. You and me, kid, we'll go far. Yeah, there's two more games to go. Don't worry about the last body, old sport. I'll do that one myself. Can I say no? I have the perfect night in place for that one. Is it your suit? <laughs> you know, that's one of the best evil laughters I've ever heard. It's better than the one that you did when you were stabbing some kids. Oh my See god, that sounds... <laughs> Just casually saying that sounds so weird, but it's a game. I mean, people shoot each other in games so often. So why would stabbing people be any different? I mean, no one's getting mad over Fortnite Battle Pass. I just crapped in my toilet, right? No one's mad about how Doom was on Mars, right? Was Doom on Mars or was that something else? I don't play first-person shooters. I've never owned an Xbox. Actually, that's a lot I did, but the only reason I got it is because someone didn't want Minecraft anymore. And I, and I still don't know where to buy Xbox games, but I'm assuming it's anywhere else normal games are sold. You leave through the window. Oh, the best detail. Tomorrow's another day. Let me guess. Give, give life? Give, oh, crap. I keep hitting the mic. Get the bodies from outside the doomster. Look, the door's open. Maybe you should have closed it. Fred Bear? No. Oh yeah, I'm using the keys, right? Yeah. Can I just, uh, yeah, do not put bodies in the Fred Bears. <laughs> I picked enough human brains out of that thing. The own guy. I feel like that's familiar. I feel like I've done that before. But where? Now, who should I do first? Uh... Chica. Hey guys, did you know Chica in Spanish means Chica, aka Chica, but in American language, Chica actually is Chica, which also means girl in, uh, uh, I was about to say American, English, I think. Actually, I want to give this to Fiaxi. Get him out of the way before I forget. Yeah. Yeah. Peek that mic, peek it and destroy all your earphones and earbuds and airpods and air, air, air headphones, maxes, maxis, and your um, what do I have, Grados, which, which Grados is it, one second, let me take off my headphones, I've got Grados X, SX60s, and they sound amazing. 
I'm glad that I invested a hundred dollars into it. Wait, I already- wait, let me go check the back room, because, you know, let's see where- oh, that's not the back room. I should've gone check there before I got to- okay, wrong room. Before I got the fourth body. Wait, can I even go in there with the- the- yeah, the, look at that. Oh, I can't put it in mine. What the heck? Well, that's weird. Uh, it seems like the body goes straight through the head. I really should get like a wrench so I can um I don't have any tokens at all. It's gonna be a bit hard to do that. I should have done that yesterday. <laughs> I kinda need tokens to buy a wrench and a taser. Wait, who else do I have to get? Like, seriously, who else do I have to get? Uh oh. Uh oh stinky. Wait, so that's six bodies. Because one of them was in Dave's suit, and the four we gave was the four that we kind of stabby-stabbed. So where'd the, where'd the six one come from? We did five. What? I guess there's just a spare body laying around. Welcome back, employee. I hope you're ready to work a hard day. Say, what's the deal with this place no deal no the kids no haunted robot no horrible mistake swept under the rug <laughs> nervous laughing no I can't choose anything else okay so uh, just to update you uh, there's been somewhat of an investigation going on uh, we may end up having to close for a few days I don't know uh, I want to emphasize though that it's really just a precaution um, it'll all get sorted out in a few days. Just keep an eye on things, and I'll keep you posted. Uh, uh, well, this uh, is the um, 19... This is 1987. Didn't the internet exist back then? I'm gonna hop on MySpace with Mr. Phone Man. Um, uh, it's been a slight change in company uh, policy concerning the use of the suits. Mmm... Uh, uh, don't. Uh, the company has deemed the suits temporarily unfit for employees. What do you mean, temporarily? Uh, I repeat, the classic suits are not to be touched, activated, or worn. That being said, we are free of liability, so do as you wish. Your job for today is just to watch the place and make sure the robots are doing A-OK -okay and make sure the kids are happy and, and alive. So, um, this place seems kind of sketchy. You tell the police anything, you're dead. We are not playing games here. See you later, employee. Uh, you know, uh, you know, um... Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Alright, alright. See ya, and remember the company motto. I'm forgetting what I said. Uh... You see a shaded figure in the distance. He beckons you to follow into the safe room. It's the purple man again. What does he want this time? Yeah, I'll save. But just in case if I do have to go back, I will uh, save a different save file. Well, I guess I'll uh, search real quick and hope I'll get like real lucky, like three hundred dollars or tokens. Sorry. Crap, nineteen. So I have until six p.m. to deactivate the robots because that's what we're gonna be doing today. Crap, that's not good. So in preparation, I guess I'll just search around real quick, and if I don't get enough tokens, I guess I'll go back to a previous day. Uh oh, that's not good. If I get loose cigarettes one more time, then I have to. It's not enough though. It's like 150 tokens. Found Bonnie's face. I don't need it. Okay, 44. I just need at least, uh, what? Well, there's five animatronics, I think, because... No, four. If there's four, and they all take 30 minutes each. So that'll be two out... Oh. 
I literally have only the right amount of time left. And if any more time gets wasted, then uh, it's kind of game over. And then the purple man's going to hate me. So how much does the wrench cost? Well, but... Hey, I'm trying to get back to where we were, but with uh, tokens. And look, I encountered a random doggo. How cute. And yes, it's Tuesday again, because I have to go back a day. Woohoo. Uh, you say goodbye to phone guy and leave. It is no longer Tuesday. It's now Wednesday again. Because that's how time works. You, you, you do Wednesday, and then you go back a day. Then it's Tuesday. Then you, when the day ends, it's Wednesday again. Ah, uh, crap. I forgot about this part. Uh, gosh darn it. Lore. Hey, look. It's me, Dreamer. And I'm about to buy a wrench. If I can remember, yeah, right there. All right, uh, wrench. Wait, 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 go back, 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 back. <laughs> yes, that's what's gonna end the video today. We get the wrench tomorrow, or the next video, I guess. To the bathroom. I guess it won't really end the video. So we got, for these, for this sort of series, I think 20 minutes is the best. You know why I think that? Because that's what I've been doing, so why change it? Oh. Hey, mind if I have a word with you? Sure, what's I'm up? I'm a member of the Denver Police Department. Where are we again? We're here conduct. An investigation? See, five local kids have gone missing. This is the last place they were seen. Local kids? Are you telling me there's global kids here? I want to know if you saw anything unusual. Why'd you speak slightly louder? Not much other than aside from a shifty customer. Fine. See you around. So, there really is an investigation. Crazy. Crazy beans. Wait, this is in the bathroom. Ah, uh, the men's toilet. One of the cleaner places of Freddy Fazbender's pizza. You know what we gotta do. We gotta pee. We gotta urinate. We gotta piss. We gotta leak. We gotta, um, go fast. Wait, how much, how much do we have in us? This is taking time because I forgot to look at how much time you spent here. But okay, it's 1.30 and now it's <laughs> It takes us 30 minutes to take a pace. Alright, stick a firecracker in the urinal. Oh uh, this is a short fuse. Youch. <laughs> Blowing up the urinals is against company policy. If people actually bothered to use those instead of just going on the floor, you'd be in big trouble. Please don't blow up any more urinals. We need it for tax reasons. Oh, th that's it? Oh, that's disappointing. Now I don't have enough money for the wrench, and now it's 2 p.m. Well, I guess that's the end of the video then. I, I go back to the. That's disappointing. I thought like the whole building would collapse. Well, I guess. Oh. Yeah, I, I guess I'll go into the office and then end the video. Actually, you know what? This. Try to enter the locked room. Dang it. But that'll be the end of the video because I say so. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. Comment, like, and subscribe. And remember, this door is firmly shut and locked. You will not get inside. Never. Never.